if you're a machine learning enthusiast, the very first thing that you want to do is to set up your machine. And in this video, I'm going to tell you top five IDE that you can install in your system if you want to develop a machine learning project. Coming up. On number five in the list, we have the IDE called Gini. Gini was originally written in C and C++ language and was released first on October 19, 2005. It is a small IDE and lightweight which weighs only 14 MB for Windows and is capable of any other IDE. It supports syntax highlighting and line numbering and also comes with features like auto-completion, auto-closing of braces, auto-closing of HTML and XML tags. It includes code folding and code navigation and one can build system to compile and execute the code with the help of external codes. The next on the list at number 4 is Rodeo. Rodeo is specifically built for machine learning projects and uses IPython as its kernel. It has easy to explore, compare and interact with data frames and plots. The Rodeo text editor comes with auto completion, syntax highlighting and built-in IPython support so that you can write code faster. Also, Rodeo has an integrated Python tutorials and includes cheat sheet for quick tutorials references. On number 3, we have Spider IDE, which stands for Scientific Python Development Environment and is written in Python. It is my personal favorite. Spider is an open source editor that supports code introspection, code completion, horizontal and vertical splitting, and go to definitions. It comes with Python and IPython console workspace and it supports debugging runtime that is as soon as you type it will display the errors. It has got a documentation viewer where it shows documentation related to classes or function called either in editor or console. It also supports variable explorer where one can explore and edit the variable that are created during the execution of a file from a graphic user interface like numpy array once. It integrates NumPy, SciPy, Matplot, and other scientific libraries. Sp Spider is best when used as an interactive console for building and testing numeric and scientific applications and script built on libraries such as NumPy, SciPy, and Matplot. The second on this list is PyCharm, which is developed by JetBrains. It comes with two versions, the community version which is always free and the professional version that has 30 days free trial. This is used by companies like HP and Twitter, so you can see it is pretty famous. It has features like code completion for classes, objects, keywords, and auto indentation and code formatting and customizable code snippet and formats. It has features for serving fast and safe refactoring. It has quick documentation and definition view where one can see the documentation or object definition in the place without losing the context. The most important feature that makes it fit for machine learning is its support for libraries such as scikit-learn, matplot, numpy and pandas. There are features like matplot interactive mode which work both in python and debugger console where one can plot, manage and explore the graphs in real time. Alright, let's move to the ID number one in this list. Can you guess what it is? It is none other than Jupyter IDE, which is very famous and almost used by everyone. It is an open source IDE that supports more than 40 programming languages, including Python, R, Scala, and Julia. It allows one to create and share the documents with equation, visualization, and most importantly, live codes. There are interactive widgets from which code can produce output such as videos, images, and latex. It has got big data integration where one can take the advantage of big data tools such as Apache Spark, Scala, Python and R. One can explore same data with libraries such as Pandas and Scikit-learn. The Markdown markup language can provide commentary for the code that is one can save logic and thought processes inside the notebook and not only in the comment section as in Python. Some of the uses of Jupyter notebook includes data cleaning, data transformation, statistical modeling and machine learning. It is currently used by popular companies such as Google, Microsoft, IBM, etc. and educational institutions such as UC Berkeley and Michigan State University. 
those are the top five IDEs that I find and the organization find it very useful for machine learning projects. Let me know in the comment section below what are your thoughts for these IDEs and if you are working on any different IDE, let us also know that. That's all from my side in this video. Thank you so much for watching till here. My name is Stephen Simon. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe my channel. See you in the next video.